Welcome to the digital age, where having a website is essential for any business. But with so many devices and screen sizes, how can you ensure your website looks great on every device? Introducing, Responsive Website Design. Upgrade to Responsive Website Design today, and give your customers, the best online experience possible. With Responsive Design, your website automatically adjusts to the screen size, of the device it's being viewed on. No more zooming in and out, or scrolling left and right. Your website will always look great, no matter the device. Get a free consultation. Contact us today at Mainstream Digicom. To whom it may concern. Just because I worked in the same field for 10 years doesn't mean it's what it was meant. You need an efficient web design strategy, search engine optimization, paid search engine marketing, or even social media marketing services. At Javalogic, we make your website work for you by getting dream customers who are asking for your services. We'll find the best keyword combinations for your business so you can rank higher in the search engines when potential customers are ready to buy. We'll create and optimize your current website so that it is beautiful, easy to navigate. So when your dream customers visit, they'll want to come back again and again. Peace, I'm Farah Hamid Freeman, founder and director of the OFC. We're also known as the One Full Circle Melanated Community Resource Hub and Network, founded October 2011. I'm honored for this opportunity to introduce you all to the OFC, but more importantly, I'm excited for what this OFC BNI collaboration will economically do for your business, your family, and our community. The OFC is dedicated to bridging the gap between the French and the English-speaking Melanated community and to empowering the community by providing culturally adapted resources and support. But the power of the OFC is in our network. We serve a community of over 16,000 members. Our members consist of entrepreneurs and business owners, as well as individuals and families. All members are committed to supporting each other in order to create a solid economic foundation for ourselves and our future generations. Within the OFC, we understand that by supporting your business, your company will expand and will eventually create employment opportunities for our youth. Our model is simple. Members come to us for products and services and we refer them to you. At the end of the day, we may have amazing products and services but we need access to clients willing to spend money in our businesses in order for us to thrive. This collaboration is doing exactly that and more. Being accepted as a member of an OFC BNI chapter means that you will benefit from the powerful business to business networking and coaching from BNI, in addition to the constant flow of clients and support from the OFC. Like BNI says, we are stronger together, but don't take my word for it. Get involved and experience the benefits for yourself. If this opportunity is right for you, let me be the first to welcome you to the OFC community and to the BNI family. To get started with the OFC, simply sign up at OFCcommunity.com. Our member success representatives are ready to be at your service. In the meantime, please remember to think of us first for all your community and business needs. Thank you again for your time and enjoy the rest of the presentation. Oh, whoops, whoops, whoops. I have to stop the video. Grand rising, beautiful people. Uh, nice seeing you all this morning. I am so grateful to life, God, our creator, and our ancestors for creating another opportunity for us to be able to get together this morning. As at the time that we spend, let it be very productive and efficient for all our entrepreneurs who are on here this morning entrepreneurs, organization, owners, as well as guests. Hotepi Menashe, you guys, I hope you're having an awesome day. So welcome to another OFC business community and business team meeting. Um, so what to expect for this morning. Uh, so uh, first of all, as you guys know, uh, this uh, this came to being because of collaboration between OFC and BNI. 
and um, and the, the desire to create more cohesion within the community uh, and best tighter bonds. So we created this uh, and actually just giving some quick context about BNI for those who don't know. Um, BNI is one of the largest business networking platforms, platforms on the planet. They have a very disciplined and stringent model uh, that they use and that works uh, for them. Uh, it's exclusively for business owners who are already in business and operating and you know scaling. Um, but not everybody's there. Uh, some people are still in the development stage. Some people are in the startup business stage. Some people um, have gone through the BNI process and just want something a little bit different. And so for that is why we have the community and business team meetings. Uh, we meet once a week now, actually twice a week, um, one at 7 a.m. and another one at 7 p.m., where we get together as entrepreneurs, community members, and in the, and organizations to present our businesses, um, to uh, share what our challenges are as entrepreneurs, and um, to also share what type of clients that we're looking for. And together, as a collective, we're here to support each other um, in our business development and our business growth. Different than other conventional networking groups, uh, we do encourage individuals to participate uh, from the community as well as just professionals. Individuals are welcome to come and share um, things that they're looking for, uh, things that they are, that they are in need of, or they're welcome to just be here as guests to just hear what is going on in the community, to hear what's new and exciting um, with businesses and organizations. And professionals are always welcome just to share what is going on with you, um, what's going on with work, and how... Um, your profession can help to better the community. Um, one of the things we do like to encourage, and um, I've, I've been making stars and circling it on my sheet, is that it um, it would be nice to see more, um, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? More commerce within the community. I would like to see, I would like for us to develop more of a habit of buying from each other, um, and supporting each other's items, following each other online, liking each other's um, platforms. Uh, these are subtle little things, but they have a huge impact. And again, the fact that we have a collective and we're, um, there's a certain cohesion that we have as members of, um, of the OFC, um, I would love to start seeing more of that within the community. So uh, as I was thinking back of the clip this morning, I'm thinking about little habits that I'm going to start to change within our community to help us to um, to make it easier for us to be able to support each other. Um, and as I make a little reference to the audio, uh, also within our business team meetings, we do start the day off at 7 a.m. with a, a excerpt from an uh, from the audio book. We have a little audio book club where we take in a little bit of um, knowledge in the morning. We share briefly about it. It's just, you know, food for thought, things to plant in our subconscious. And again, the goal is to help us all as entrepreneurs and individuals. Um, and then when time does allow, we also listen to a motivational um, clip, um, which just morning I thought was really awesome as well. Just the power of the mind and power of the subconscious. Very, very powerful things. Um, other quick things to, to remember is, uh, so as we start our meetings, first off, we're going to hear from our affiliates, and the affiliates are the uh, business owners and uh, heads of organizations who are here to serve the need of our community. So they will present themselves, let you guys know who they are, what they do, and how they can be of service to you. And then we'll open up the floor to the entrepreneurs to do the same. Again, who you are, what your business is about any challenges that you're facing as an entrepreneur and the type of clients that you're looking for and the kind of support that you need. Um, each person, as we do our, our round table, has about 90 seconds uh, to be able to present. Uh, if you're new, you know, we give you two minutes so you could just ball out with the time. Um, and uh, when you're, when your time is, uh, is passed, you will see me flaring my hand, my phone, whatever, just to get your attention so that you know that time has uh, has passed. Um, also, c'est important de savoir que nos rencontres sont complètement bilingues. So our meetings are completely bilingual. Donc, uh, je ne veux pas de, de communiquer dans la langue de votre choix. So please do not hesitate to communicate in the language of your choice. And if needed, we will translate. Si nécessaire, on va traduire. All right. And then as we are closing up our meeting, we will allocate time at the end for our featured guests, which today is our brother Darren, um, travel agent from uh, with Vasco Travels, um, who will connect. Um, he uh, will have uh, more time to deep dive, about 10 minutes or so, if he so chooses um, to deep dive about a, a little bit about himself, his background, 
um, his business and how it could better uh, support us or help us and how we can get better access to it. Um, and then we'll have an opportunity to ask him a couple of questions, um, you know, just for clarity if needed. All right. Um, I think I've ran through my spiel of things to remember every week. Um, so with that, let's dive right in. And if I forgot anything, I'll just randomly chime it in uh, as we go throughout this uh, this morning. So, all right, let's open it up for our first affiliate. Uh, I see him on the screen, Grand Rising. Ken, how are you doing this morning? I'm doing great, Farrell. Thank you for asking. Grand Rising, everybody. I'm Ken Ingram, also known as Uncle Ken in the OFC. I'm the business trainer and coach in the group. Most of us look at training and coaching as an expense. Well, if athletes actually believe that, they would never win gold medals. So why do we, as business owners, try to do it on our own? Why do we try to have gold medal financial years without any help and support? Training and coaching. Trainers and coaches, they help you to do the things right. They help you to build the habits and behaviors to win. Yes, to win. Well, I need your help to find four to five business owners ready to sign up for my sales training program at the beginning of May. The program is 12 sessions of two hours and for OFC members, ongoing free support. Wow, what a deal. Do your friends and family a favor and encourage them to learn the sales skills and habits that will help them to get the results they need and they want for their business. Help them to take control, be proactive and be the master of their destiny. Wow, I'm here for that. I think it's a great deal. I hope you do as well. Help me, please, please. Show the love. 514-668-2320 is how you can reach me. Or you can uh, go through the OFC website. You'll find my information there and connect with me. I look forward to speaking to you at your earliest opportunity. Thank you for that, Ken. Um, awesome and great energy. And as you uh, said, your phone number, you just reminded me that I forgot to remind you guys to make sure to stay your um, contact information because we do record these sessions and we load them up onto YouTube after. So if anybody else wants to see it after the fact, they'll be able to still grab your contact info. But I also want to encourage you guys to put your contacts in the chat. Um, it is uh, We are always here to network and to connect with each other. So we want to um, encourage you to do that. On a side note, Farrell, I do buy Paul Wallace's products, Pure Trim. Mm -hmm. I have given referrals to Darren. I don't know if it's worked out. I've sent people to Keenan Group as well. Um, I bought uh, uh, Carlene's uh, husband's uh, um, hot sauce. Uh, alcohol and oh, I nice. bought hot sauce. And I am encouraging everybody in the community. So come on, show a bit of love to Ken. I, I I appreciate it, and and that's uh, actually that's uh, a gr great example because that's really what it's about. We are here um, to purchase and support each other, and that's how we're going to grow as a community. I have a couple of nuggets for you, actually, Ken. Um, first of all, are you registered with the group thirty seven thirty seven as a supplier? No. Okay, so if you could contact them, you can be. You could let them know you're referred by me, um, and um, and with that, actually, they put you in a database where everybody who has been funded by 3737 can refer to you um, as a service provider. So that is a, a nugget for you. <clears throat> and I'm also going to encourage that you make a note to follow up with Westcan. I think there could be a, an opportunity for coaching there as well. Okay. Very cool. good. Thank you. My pleasure. And that's what we are here for. Next. Da, 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 da. Sister Kemba. Just camera, you up? Just camera. Uh, did, did she leave me any notes that I didn't pay attention to yet? Hold on, let's see. <laughs> she did that last week and I didn't notice. Okay, no, yeah. Sorry, I um, was having some trouble getting back to the phone. No, I apologize. Um, so, can I can I have two seconds before my? 30, 90 seconds. Yeah, of course. Um, just to say something about coaching. And so um, Ken is very right. Coaching is hugely important and sales coaching is hugely important. Um, I haven't actually signed up for Ken's um, coaching yet, but I think it's a really good idea as a person who's um, coming from, you know, prior to starting my business, I was an employee for a long time. It's a different set of skills. It's a different set of behaviors. It's it's just, 
you know, you learn as you go, but it's super helpful to have somebody sort of show you the ropes just as you're getting started. So I do encourage people to, you know, do the coaching in whatever area you're trying to build in. So if you're trying to grow a business, get some sales coaching, get some business coaching. Um, if you're trying to do real estate, get some business <laughs> some real estate. <laughs> Anyways, I'll, I'll tell you about, about me. And um, so my name is uh, Kemba Williams. I'm the co-founder of the Keen Real Estate Group. Uh, we do a plethora of things, but that includes uh, property management in the GTA area. Uh, we do a lot of investments. So we take our own funds and put them into various real estate investments, but we also bring folks together who are interested in partnering and buying real estate together. So we teach you how to do that. A huge component of our business is education and coaching so come find out how you can learn what you need to know about coaching a quick story I had a someone call me yesterday and they can't close on a property that they've put an offer in and it's it's so unfortunate you know because there was certain things certain advice they got certain information they got that was misleading and it's it's put them in a really difficult position they're going to lose their deposit. Um, I don't like to see that happen because it's so avoidable if you know what you need to do ahead of time to be prepared. And maybe some of us are aware of that, but many of us who really have aspirations for real estate don't know some of the key things that will help us be successful. So it's just, you know, take the time to learn about what it is you want to do before you jump into it. Uh -huh. Thank and call you. me, 416-821-5765. <laughs> Check out our website keengroup.ca um you know come learn and come grow and come build wealth awesome thank you kemba thank you for sharing that thank you for the advice um yeah like we're all it's a it's it, it's a an interesting time on the planet and it's definitely um the, the more we know the better it is to navigate and uh yeah and, and avoid certain pitfalls so to speak so um yeah thank you for sharing that and thank you for the encouragement and just thank you for what you're doing within the community. No um, next we have so in terms of next Ophelia, so we have our sister Alvina, Dr. Alvina Ryan, Grand Rising, and just so you guys know, um, all for our guests and visitors, uh, Alvina does reach out to touch base. She is a part of our welcoming team, so she does like to touch base with the visitors and the uh, guests who are attending. So thank you, Alvina, for what you do for the community, and the floor is yours. Thank you, Farrell. So good morning, everybody. So I think as I was listening today, a common theme is you don't know what you don't know. So if you don't know anything about sales and you're opening a business, you should get coaching. If you don't know anything about real estate, look what happened to this person. They might lose their deposit. Um, you should go get advice before you get into this whole home buying thing. Same thing with what I do. I'm a damage insurance agent, which means I help you with the insurance portion that you need for your car or your home. And most people, let's face it, you've never read that contract. You don't know what guarantees you need on your home. So you need to trust an agent and make sure that they are helping you protect your greatest asset, whether it be your home or your car. Even we do pet insurance. So a lot of people don't even know that about our company, but you have an animal, it gets sick, and all of a sudden, Kemba just talked about preserving your, your wealth. All of a sudden you're lacking funds, but what are you gonna do? Let your pet die or you're gonna have the insurance ahead of time. So Alvina Ryan, damage insurance agent, call today, don't delay, 514-990-9539. Thank you. Amazing, thank you, Alvina. <laughs> Thank you for the encouragement. Um, I was just talking to Shy about us getting insurance for our dog, so or one of them, not all three, but it's something we will be looking into in the future. Um, awesome. So, all right, guys. So now let's transition into the rest of our amazing business team. So I thank all the affiliates um, who are here with us. Next up, so Grand Rising brother Paul Wallace, glad to see you here. Oh, you're on mute. Uh, hi, everyone. I'm, I'm glad to be here. Uh, actually, I was just coming in today to spectate and to um, see all the good things that's happening with the OFC. 
Uh, it's been a while since I've been here. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, so a quick plug. What I basically do is I'm a health counselor. So um, I like to sit down and listen to everyone speak and, uh, you know, talk about what's ailing them. And of course, we'll have a nice conversation about that. And if they so choose that they want to get healthy, they could easily just um, hire me or take me on. And then we'll walk through their healing process together. Uh, I'll, I, I placed it in the chat. Uh, they can call me for a consultation. 15 minutes, free speaking. That's it. And then we'll see, we'll take it from there. Amazing. Thank you so much, Brother Paul. And I shall use this opportunity to, to do a quick little plug and to share some awesome news. So just recently, the OFC, we are awarded a grant that's going to help us to develop our OFC Holistic Healing Retreat and our campground. Um, and Paul is one of our health providers that are on site. So guys, I'm really excited for um, for everything that's happening and for what we're able to do for the community. Healing is extremely important. Physical mental spiritual um like we're in a point in a place right now guys where we're we're going through it we all know like uh, the universe is going through it the planet is going through it and us as the um a re <laughs> as humans on this planet we're going through it as well um so anything we can do to boost our immune systems to um to to just get physically fit um just healthier in in on all uh, aspects is really um, it's it's important and it's something to focus on and I'm glad to be able to I'm glad that we have Paul within the collective to be able to provide um, these services to the community and the products that he sells that he sells does work um, from the uh, the the health the the weight loss ones to the detox um, very very necessary so again thank you Paul for what you're doing for the community and I strongly encourage people to reach out and to connect all right next up. All right, so we have brother and sister Janet Cox. <laughs> Janet and Fred Cox. <laughs> okay, don't put okay, on don't, okay, don't. Okay, don't. Yeah, okay, go don't. Ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Put Just, on your microphone. Frederick, can you talk in the meantime? No. Oh. It's there already. Just have it on. Okay. Just half a second, folks. No problem. It's one of these mornings. Take your time. Yeah. Just being challenged a little bit. Okay, so Grand Rising, everyone. Um, I wanted Frederick to talk first while I got ready, but he's not cooperating. <laughs> but Ken, I heard you mention a lot of names. I didn't hear Liquid Green. So on this weekend, we'll get a chance to meet up and we'll bring Liquid Green for you, okay? Amen. <laughs> That's what we're here for. <laughs> okay. Um, And of course, Ken, you know, we're still trying to get a meeting with a few people. Anyway, now I'll start. Um, no, I am here to represent a company called Novatech, and uh, I was reading something this morning, and it says, Um, why am I struggling? With it? You can't read, just a minute. No, it says it come it comes down to three simple factors in terms of building wealth. What are real opportunities? Who's investing in these opportunities? And most importantly, where are these opportunities found? And the reason that was important is because it says in America, 1% of Americans own more wealth than the entire middle class. And it also says that 90% of the U.S. stock market um, is owned by only 10% of Americans. The reason I'm saying this is there is another opportunity that we have just learned about. It's called CMB. And we are going to be talking about this as we move on with OFC. I'm just to send, giving the name out because within the space, there are many, many opportunities. Novatech continues to be an excellent opportunity, but there are some changes that have been made. And again, once we get a chance, we'll, um, Farah would like to talk a little bit more about how things are changing and what some of the new opportunities are. Oh, so nice. my name is Janet Cox and my phone number is 905-231-1663. 905-231-1663. And I needed coaching to have made that presentation this morning. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Janet. 
And mm -hmm. I don't know how Ken did, but Ken was just displaying some liquid green product. So Ken Ken has ordered his liquid green. Okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Good. Uh, okay. <laughs> that is awesome. You see, watch. I'm I'm gonna start doing something where we're gonna all have to show products that we bought from each other. All right. <laughs> Forgot <laughs> to mention Sabrina as well. Yes. Nice. I got hot sauce. I got it almost everything actually. Uh, see, I see, guys. I'm telling you, we're gonna start doing this and making it like a game. It's gonna be like, all right, guys, the shore products. Who bought what from who this week? <laughs> I even have big wheel t-shirts. Oh, you see, Ken, uh, we appreciate you, Ken. We appreciate you. All right, guys. And this is the spirit we want to continue to encourage. All right, Brother Fred, you are up. Liquid green that I had to use this morning. My dog threw up, so I was cleaning up. And, um, you know, <laughs> uh, thank you for that. Liquid green did the job. Next time, next time, give the dog some to drink. It will settle his stomach. Really? Okay. <laughs> Say less, my friend. Less. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Uh, nice to be here. It is an amazing morning, as of course, because we're into spring. So come spring, comes new energy, new ideas, new enthusiasm. And with that, I'd like you to spring say. Cleaning. <laughs> uh goodbye to the harmful chemicals and say hello to mother nature because we want you to breathe easier we want you to use products that will not uh choke you when you use it wouldn't have any toxic fumes and we also would like you to help us to save the planet you know one clean at a time so with liquid green you get more bang for your buck because we give you products that are uh you know effective in doing what they do and I uh, just want to remind everyone that we are coming to Montreal this weekend. We're bringing cases up. So uh, for those of you that are thinking of buying and how are you going to be getting it, we will have it on site on this weekend. All right. We have a special that's on uh, a family, uh, rather a case of four. It's only $90, folks. It includes the taxes no and shipping. no shipping this time because <laughs> we're bringing it to you. Amazing. Okay. So make sure, you know, get your friends and your relatives, get them together, tell them liquid green is coming. Okay, that's uh, it. I have the information in the chat. Get a free order. Okay, so we, you know, we're looking out, send your orders in so we'll know, you know, what you need. And mm. Good, great idea. Oh, you just went on mute. Um, but yes, great idea. Thank you for that, Brother Fred. Um, so yeah, and guys, I strongly encourage if you haven't yet, put in your pre-order so they, um, so you can pick up your product once they get here. Brother Fred, did you get a chance to connect with um, Brother Eric at um, um, EDIA? You didn't get it yet? I'm going to give it to you now. Okay, cool. And so while I get you the phone number, I will go on to our next guest. Hey, and actually, Wink has entered the building. Let's Wink, Grand Rising Queen. Yes, good afternoon, or oh, grand rising for you all. It's good afternoon for me. Yes, uh, my name is Chantal from Wink and the co CEO. Uh, Wink provides virtual support services. So, um, you know, we work with a lot of um, with the VA companies, and a lot of them, they don't actually train their, their employees properly, and they don't have a real idea of confidentiality and, and security in terms of information. So, at Wink, we definitely work to, to change that. Uh, we have systems uh, designed in order to really uh, make sure that our, our assistants are trained and they are knowledgeable in the sense of how to keep your information secure and private. Uh, we work with a wide range of businesses from, uh, from the OFC. We provide the, the member support services um, and also from moving companies to real estate to um, graphic design to um, even accounting companies. Uh, so we work with a huge a range of businesses and we provide administration, customer service, sales, bookkeeping, uh, web design and graphic design and much more. And that's it. Chantal. Yes, thank you. Awesome. Thank you, Chantal. Thank you, Wink, for what you guys do for us, for the community um, at large. And again, like uh, the power of the us being able to support our brothers and sisters back on the continent while you all support us here in uh, North America is exceptional. Um, yeah, it's just it, it's great to be able to have this um, the cycle going full circle. I don't know how much other uh, uh, how many other organizations, you know, uh, within Canada can say that they're doing that, can say that they're supporting um, businesses and organizations across Canada, as well as empowering our brothers and sisters on the continent. But I'm proud to be able to be um, part many. of this collective. You know, yes. this is awesome. And guys, this is this is it. This is why we do what we do. Alrighty, let's go on to next guest. Uh, da, 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 
Grand Rising Queen, uh, Sister Nora, Bond Through Touch, glad to have you on here this morning. Good morning, everyone. My name is Nora, and I am the owner of Bond Through Touch Massage and Holistic Therapy. I work with the families and uh, the community by helping people connect through the art of holistic touch and therapy. So if you need any more information, you can contact me at 514-707-3670 or bond through touch at gmail.com. Amazing, thank you. I'm a little chatty this morning. I have a question for you. Um, for your services, uh, is it something like if people are going are grieving, is it um it, is is your service something that's available to them? Yes. So we do workshops through um, well, it depends on the type of service that they need, but if they're grieving, then we can do like conversations and have parents open that conversation with their children and we can do activities through touch and talking about that too okay all right so let's uh let's follow up after and i would also like to discuss with you maybe um putting together a workshop for the healing retreat the ofc healing retreat for this uh this summer i think that could be really fun sounds good do you have a timeline though when that's going to be mm, not sure yet but we'll take it offline i'll reach out to you and we'll uh we'll coordinate it just made a little asterisk next to your name here so i'll reach out sounds good <laughs> thank, thank you for me. thank you um i feel uh did i just put it in the chat fred did i put the contact yeah i just put um eric's contact in the chat fred janet so you guys are clicky there you should you should have his phone number and everything you got it okay good um okay thank you guys all right next sister carleen grand rising queen Good morning, everybody. Okay. Just saying hi. Hey. I'm at the office. Okay. Have a great day. Nice okay. to hear from you all. Awesome. Nice to see you, sister. Okay, cool. Sister Carleen's uh, so she's a guest for today. Um, but I will give her a quick shout out because she does sell amazing hot sauce. So anybody who is needs to spice up your life, you definitely want to connect with Sister Carleen. All right. Oh yes, and alcohol. Thank you, Ken, for that. <laughs> 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 we all have the sign language for drinking alcohol we know what that means good thank you um all right next up um are, okay we have a guest soon to be um active member of the ofc our brother malik um who was uh, invited by sister um janet and brother fred so i thank you guys for the invite and brother malik welcome to the ofc um community and you are welcome to introduce yourself and your business. Hi, my name is Malik, and my business is called NNM Snack Inc. We own vending machines. I have eight in Ontario and eight in Quebec. We also use our platform to basically spread passive income awareness. And that's what we do. I could leave um, the Instagram link and the website link in the chat. Mm -hmm. and, yeah. Please and actually, can, well, can you mention um just for those who who might not have access to the chat, can you say what the um, what your handles are on uh, uh yeah Instagram? Well, it's kind of long, but if you just type in um N and M Snack Inc, it should pop up. Okay, okay. and then our website is www.nmsnackinc.ca. Amazing, thank you. Um, and uh, and so for everybody out there, um, if you have a a location like you, so you have staff, you have employees, or you have a high traffic location definitely reach out to brother malik it'd be awesome to be able to put one of his vending machines in your facility um to be able to uh help and serve your your needs actually darren when you're up i'm going to ask you because maybe even for the travel agency i don't know if you guys have a vending machine in there but maybe you could pop one in there um you know so you guys don't have to go anywhere for your snacks so that could be a cool connection there awesome um okay i have an iphone here um normally i would have removed it but i feel like it's a member of the ofc because i see his iphone show up pretty often um so iphone can you introduce yourself for us please <laughs> Okay, wait. Yes. I have invited someone, um, Pharaoh. I don't know if it's that person, okay? Oh, okay. Well, but she's, if... she might be on the on the metro. Yeah? Okay. Yeah. Okay. But I'm going to check and let you know. Yes, please. Yeah. Oh. Cause I believe that's me. Sorry. Oh. Okay, perfect. So that person. Hey. Yes. Yeah. Rising. 
Yeah, it's crazy morning, crazy morning. Good morning, everybody. This is uh, Dwayne Harris, uh, owner of uh, Fun Zone and uh, Jam Jerk Restaurant. Um, also have a private daycare, so start my days early, finish my days late. So, uh, yeah, haven't been uh, able to make it, but I made it on today. Nice. So um, good to good to thank you, Pharaoh, Darren, my brother. Shout me out every week, big me up. So, if you guys, have any of your catering needs or even snack needs through the restaurant? We'll be able to provide for birthdays, weddings, events, even dinners. Uh, we do deliver full catering out for Fun Zone for uh, all your party needs. Um, whether it's a private party, um, get together with the entire family and friends, or just uh, you're coming out to have a fun day um fun zone's the place you want to be contact me um i will be posting we're trying to have uh events so we will be hosting our first uh easter event uh this this april 8th um so opening to the public trying to uh offer things for the kids to get back on track after you know shut down and everything trying to offer things that we used to have as kids so you know trying to connect back to the give back to the community connect back to the community the cost for that event is ten dollars uh per child um and every child leaves with a little surprise as well so there'll be a fun day of events and and stuff to do that morning um and then you're you're invited to stay at fun zone as long as you please after that so it's uh it's gonna be a fun morning fun day uh, and what, and, sorry, uh, what was the date then of, of that uh, that was uh, April 8th, uh, okay. so that's uh, the Easter weekend, and uh, we'll be starting over there around uh, 9 o'clock. Oh. Um, the event's going to be going till uh, 11, 12-ish, uh, you know, <laughs> um, yeah. but then, uh, like you said, like I said, uh, after that, uh, you guys can stay or leave, uh, decide to have lunch there, etc. It's just going to be a fun day. But... my brother thank you so much and th and one thank you for joining thank you for being here this morning and so this is the Dwayne that we shout out every week Darren's brother <laughs> so so glad yeah. to be able to have you on here with us today um yeah. and definitely like if we need to really reach out um uh we could have a, a quick one-on-one -on -one to see how uh how else the orbs could help for that event April 8th I think that's exceptional and if we could help to uh, spread the word and maybe reach out to some of our youth networks um, or we have a couple, we have a homeschooling group. We have uh, a couple of youth organizations that work uh, a lot with children. Um, so we could reach out and try to mobilize them as groups to come out and to participate. I think that's exceptional. Yeah, definitely. I'm always opening to working with them. I'm currently working with Heads and Hands on an event in May that they're having. I work with uh, West Haven Center to help with their promotional and uh, invite. Amazing. And I also work with Westminster Children's Library. Okay. So whether it's through Fun Zone or whether it's through the uh, restaurant, we're always open to, to helping out and giving back. Thank you, Brother Dwayne. So we definitely will be in touch. Um, I might even yeah. need a couple of things from you for this workshop coming up this weekend, but we'll talk about that offline. So thank yeah. you, my brother. I appreciate you having, I appreciate having you. All right. Thank you. Have a good morning. Cool. You too. Back All to right. work. <laughs> Back to work. <laughs> Back to work. Cool. All righty. So now I think I've gone to everybody. I think it's my turn and then we will seat the floor to our brother Darren. So um, so I'm Faro, uh, the founder and director of the OFC. I'm proud to be. Um, as you guys see, the OFC, we are a community. Um, we're a community first. I like to uh, make sure everybody understands that. We are not a conventional networking platform or a business networking platform. We are a community. So we're here at the service of all. We're here to unite the community. We're here to unite the English and the French, the white and the black, the tall and the short. We're really just here to bridge between everybody within the community um, and to create this sense of cohesion. Um, and the, our overall goal is to build an economic so, uh, solid economic foundation for our future generation. So anybody who resonates with that, who shares that vision, who likes our values as a collective, they're welcome to join and be a part of the OFC community. Uh, we are self-financed. We are funded by the members of the community who contribute on a monthly or annual basis to um, support us in what we're doing for you all. Um, but even if you're not an active member of the OFC and you need help, you're always welcome to come to the OFC. It's our pleasure to help and to serve. 
Um, and uh, so a couple of quick plugs, things that we have within the community, just to remind you guys, every week we have our podcast and radio show uh, that we use to promote you all in terms of businesses and organizations within the community. So if you would like some extra promo, please reach out. We could coordinate to have you come on to the show and to come and promote and let the community know who you are and what you do. Again, everything that we do is for you all in terms of members of the community. So please take advantage. On that, I want to also uh, plug our community platform, ofclink.com. That's where you can find each other um, on there. And if you go on there and you do not find yourself or you don't find a member that you're looking for, please reach out to us because we're still in the process with the help of Wink. I'm just cleaning up our the platform to ensure that we have all the right um, keywords for all the members so that you guys can find each other on the platform. We have over a thousand businesses on there within the melanated community. Um, and, you know, these are all business owners that are dedicated to supporting you all and supporting community. So I want to encourage you guys, but please, at the very least, make sure that when you search, you could find yourself. And if you don't, let us know so we can fix that ASAP. Um, because uh, it, over the next couple of weeks, you guys are going to start seeing more promo for the OFC link. And it's going to be a shame that we're driving all this traffic to promote you guys and people can't find your profiles. So please, please, please make that effort. Um, another quick plug. Uh, we have started the uh, meditation, um, uh, meditation workshop. Uh, it's a bi-weekly. It's every Wednesday evening. Uh, Sister Carlene, it's at 8 p.m., right? Uh, I, I, I should have noted that. But yes, if I'm not mistaken, it's at 8 p.m. Um, when is it 8 or 7? Yes, 8, 8 p.m. Yeah. yeah, okay, thanks. Yeah, so 8 p.m. every second Wednesday. But it's uh, there's a bit of a commitment. So um, this we had the intro session um, two weeks ago. We have another session tomorrow. Um, yeah, so if anybody's still interested in, in coming in to see what it's about, I, I strongly recommend it. We had an exceptional first session, very groundbreaking, very spiritually opening, eye-opening. Um, and again, it's just great for creating bonds. Everybody's welcome to join and participate. Um, so uh, I think I have, you know, I'll check and see, make sure I have the registration link. But even if I don't and you're interested, just reach out, send a quick DM and I'll make it a, make it a point to make sure that you're registered. Yes, Sister Kemba. I didn't want you to forget Real Estate 101 coming up too. Thank you. Good. Because I had. So that's good. I'm glad you mentioned that. <laughs> good. So we do have. Uh, actually, well, Kemba, just to remind us, what's the date coming up? And let me get the link right now while you're doing that. Uh, I put it in the chat and it's coming up on April 8th. We're going to be talking about insurance and real estate. Sorry. Mm, okay good and i'm gonna put our uh put the link for the real estate 101 now in the chat oh you put it already well i'll put it again just in case um so people can register and then i'll find the one for the meditation as well so i could plug that one in here too um i have two more exciting things so um we have two workshops coming up this week so i don't know let me see for people can i can i get a testimony from somebody who was there last week uh well shoot darren you were there last week can you give a quick little testimony how what, what was your experience with the workshop last week uh yes definitely so the workshop uh last week it was a lot of things um a lot of opportunities for like um gaining like uh grants um, gaining income for if you're interested in starting your business. Um, also opportunities um, and information was given uh, um, if you have a business as well. And um, there was, we saw guests from uh, the Cote de Neige uh, Community Center. Um, and definitely um, also there was... Um, Another guest too, there was brother, well, there was LFC members were there as well, like uh, brother Dali, he was there um, yes. and definitely was good to connect. Um, there is also that organization. Um, Fon Afro uh, Pernara. Fon so Afro, yes. So thank you. And, uh, so, and I'll, I'll, I'll tag in with the other ones because it is, and thank you, Darren. So, so overall, you did enjoy the experience. Okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> so good. So basically, so this is what we're doing. So a uh, reminder, the OFC, we're um, working con in collaboration with BEC. So that's the Black Entrepreneurial Knowledge Hub. So they are doing a national study basically national across Canada, uh, to assess the needs of entrepreneurs and organizations. And of the OFC, we're proud to be helping to coordinate the for the province of Quebec. So um, we are hosting a series of workshops. So last week was a workshop on communication um, where we brought out Fimo Mitchell and we had some fun there and um, had an, a very interactive workshop. But what more importantly, what we're doing is helping to mobilize. I, I'm not sure if you guys are aware, but there was $24 million dollars um, that was distributed throughout the province of Quebec to help you all in terms of entrepreneurs. But a lot of business owners are not um, accessing it and do not um, know that the funds are available. So what we've been doing is mobilizing the organizations that are managing this fund um, and who are here to serve you. Uh, we've been bringing them out for them to be able to present themselves uh, to you all. Uh, so you guys can connect with them directly, understand the services that they offer, it's an exceptional opportunity to be able to connect and to network. Um, so we have two more workshops uh, coming up. So we have one this coming Friday, 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. at the historic UNIA. That's um, downtown Montreal, corner of Atwater and Notre Dame. And um, we have another one, same location on the Saturday. And this is uh, from 10 to 3 p.m. It's an all-day workshop. And this is with Jarvis Gray. Uh, I'm going to play a quick little commercial that Jarvis created for us. And then we will... And yeah, no, I think that's it for my that's it for my um my my ads and things in terms of things I have going on. And now we're we're going to cede the floor to Brother Darren. So let me just play this clip real quick. And then we will cede the floor to our brother Darren, who is going to bring us through his travel journeys. Um, and actually, sorry guys, I'm all over the place. I'm going to send you guys i'm going to share right now also the links to register for friday and saturday i'd love to see you guys come out if you can't make it if you could do me a huge favor and share it um with anybody that you feel can benefit guys because this is our goal is to ensure that you guys have access to the information and access to the resources that are available to you um and anybody else who is in need can also Quick get access yep I, I know these meetings are are in person but yes. is it possible to have any sort of virtual element? Uh, I feel like businesses like myself, um, well, I would love to be to take in, in part in these uh, in these workshops mainly because these businesses that are getting funded, they're going to need support in order to then help them grow and utilize the funds, right? Yes. So using uh, virtual assistants could definitely help businesses. Yeah. You are absolutely right. That's a very good question and very good point. Um, okay, remind me. Let me see what we can do. Because, yeah, they're definitely all in person. We don't, We aren't offering a virtual component for this one. Mm -hmm. um, maybe we could discuss um, a little pre-recorded message that we could air um, to create some type of awareness. Um, we have some options. Okay, so, okay. yeah. So, let's, uh, let's take that offline. Um, that would be awesome. Um, so, good. Good point. And, yes, Mr. Janet? Janet? Uh, hold on. No, I'm not seeing you. Janet, I see your hand, but I'm not. Is that an old hand? Was that up before? Okay, Hi. well, I'm not sure. So, Janet, I'm not sure what's I'm, happening. I'm using a different computer, and it's just such a challenge this morning. I just wanted to ask permission at the end at the presentation. I just want to save a date for a event that's coming up with the African Union. So I won't do it now, but I'll do it at the end. So just a heads up. Thank you. No problem at all. All right, one second. Let me play this and mute this. Hey, blessings and good. Hey, blessings and good day, OFC family. Jarvis Gray here, just dropping a real quick video. 
to say that I can't wait to come into town this week. Um, my son and I, we're coming to visit with you all. We get in on Thursday, Friday night. If you're available, please come out, join us, network with us. We are going to be hosting something that I call a hot seat mastermind, which is such an amazing, fun networking event, a chance to literally have your biggest questions about growing your business answered by a community of other business owners. So that's Friday night when we get in uh, Saturday. Saturday is going to be the event that you absolutely cannot miss. So if you all had a chance to plug into the virtual event that we did back around January, um, that was the first beginning parts of the conversation, all about business growth and development strategies, literally the ones that I use with my, um, with my clients and other business owners here in the States. Now we're bringing it to Montreal so you can expect a better conversation, a much deeper, a much more enriched conversation than the one that we started having a few months ago. So I definitely want you all to come out, be a part of the conversation. My goal by the end of that, by the end of that entire workshop is to show you the next steps for moving your business forward while I'm there in person. You are more than welcome. I encourage you, please ask me anything. I'm willing to share all of my business coaching secrets to make sure that you will leave that event with some new strategies, new ideas to grow and go further in the rest of this year and even beyond that. So again, just wanted to drop this quick video to let you know we're coming to town. I'm coming to meet you. I want to um, break bread. I want to enjoy you know, the conversations, enjoy in some laughs. Unfortunately, with some of these conversations, we might share some tears because I know, I know how frustrating it can be to be a business owner with so many goals and a lot of things stacked against you. So that's why I do what I do. That's why I know Pharaoh does what he does in leading the OFC, um, even our partners in Beck. That's why they believe in this mission so much is because we want to see everyone win on this entrepreneurial journey. So again, Jarvis Gray here. Cannot wait to get into town, to meet you all, to collaborate with you. So please come out. Let's show up. Let's support each other. And let's support everything that the OFC is pulling together as great resources for business success. So thank you. And I'll see you on Friday. Peace. Great. That worked out. Awesome little uh, commercial that you guys know what is going on. So good. So looking forward to seeing you all. So with no further ado, let open up the floor to our brother, Darren. Hey, person, I see you. Okay, I'll let you speak after Darren. So peace, brother Darren. The floor is yours. Hello, hello, everybody. All right. So I work in travel um, and I am a travel agent. But instead of agent, let's say travel consultant. And um, a lot of you might wonder, what is the point of using a travel consultant? What is, why do I need a travel consultant? Especially now when the internet is so vast, so big, you might be wondering, well, I use Expedia. You might be wondering, it's easy, so easy now to just, book a flight and book your trip through Expedia. You see um, that flight for $4.99 or $500 flashing on your screen on Expedia website. And then you're like, okay, no point in using a travel agent, right? I'll just book the flight myself. But many a times that price that you see for $4.99, $5.99, Behind it, you're going through Atlanta, you're connecting through this country, you're doing like four stops, you're doing an eight-hour layover, and it starts to become a nightmare and a headache, and you're like, oh my goodness. And that $4.99 flight or $5.99 flight that you saw turns into a nightmare. You see, with a travel consultant, we're able to book you flights. We sit down with you. We work with you. We ask you for your budget. We're able to work with you. Many a times, I don't know if many of you remember, but there was a catastrophe with the airlines, especially with lost baggage. That was a headache. Imagine you're going on your trip to find out that your baggage didn't make it to destination. That is stress, that is headache. That is something definitely that you're gonna be like, really? You see, when you take a vacation, you think of vacation as a time to relax, a time to rejuvenate, a time to 
rests. So hearing that your baggage has been lost is not a good start to your vacation. That's going to put a very bad taste in your mouth. So many a times you're going to be like, I'm not flying with this airline again. And then even to call the airline just to speak to somebody, you're going to get that recorded in that uh, our reps are unavailable at the moment. You're on hold. You're on hold for maybe like hours. That's buying into your vacation time. So we as travel consultants, we take care of that for you. We can save you time because time is precious. Instead of you wasting time on your vacation and you're supposed to enjoy your time, we as travel agents will take that. All you need to do is give us a call. Darren, listen, my baggage didn't make it to destination or I'm stuck at the airport and they're giving me trouble. You just give us a call. No problem. We will take care of that for you. And you see with our services as uh, travel consultants, there, there's a fee that you pay, but that fee covers everything. That fee is only a one-time fee, and it gets charged once you give us the okay to book that vacation for you or to book that flight for you. So pretty much for a one-time fee of like $50, you're saving in the end. You're saving in the long run. You have us from the start of your vacation even before you go on that vacation, we work together. We go back and forth. There's times when we're like, if there's a price that you don't like or you think the price is too high, that's okay. We work together until we get the price that you can afford that you like that's in your budget. Many a times, we take the stress out of your headache with the lost baggage. We deal with that for you. We make sure that your vacation is stress-free and hassle-free. So you don't need to worry about anything. You, you just need to focus on your time, your vacation, and enjoying your vacation to the fullest. Even when you come back, if something goes wrong, to the extent that uh, the hotel staff was rude, for example, or even on your flight, the flight attendant gave you attitude, when you don't worry about that. Just take note of that. When you come back, we're also there to take care of you. It's not like, well all right, this customer booked and we got his money. So when he comes back, that's it, that's all. No, we follow up with you. We want to know, okay, how did your vacation go? How did that flight go? How was everything? Did you have a smooth experience? Um, what could we? What could have been better? What could have, um, what were some of the delays, some of the hassles? We take all that and we like to hear feedback from people because that's how we can all improve, right? That's how we can also know, well, okay, uh, so Air Canada is not doing so great or a lot of people are not getting good service from Air Canada. So that way we also can reach out to them and let them know like, hey, we're giving you guys business and what's going on? Um, so definitely there are benefits to using a travel agent. Um, with the travel agent as well, Many times businesses, they have certain hours from like nine to five. And after that, it's like you're on your own. Yes, we do have certain business hours when we're in office and when we are there, when staff is there to, in office to meet you. However, technically we're around the clock because you have my personal contact number where you're able to call me. So if anything happens and it's an emergency situation, off hours or outside of hours, you're stuck at the airport and you need our services and assistance, we're there definitely to intervene. It's just a phone call, a text, um, an email, anything. We're like there that. behind you to take care of you. Um, I just want to, many of you might be wondering, well, Vacation and traveling and prices of vacation is expensive. But definitely, there are resources available. There's financing plans, financing options. There's a program. It's called Uplift. What they do, Uplift, is, and I've seen people use it even the day before their vacation. They want to go on a vacation. Uplift does a soft credit check. 
And what they do, once you pass that soft credit check, they pay for your vacation in entirety. So if your vacation, I don't know, is $1,000 and you sign up, you put your information with Uplift. If some of you who may not be computer savvy, um, we could sit down together, put your information together and send it off to Uplift. And once it's approved, you get an answer like right away. They send you an answer to your um, email directly or they text you an answer to let you know whether you're approved or not. And so even me as a travel consultant, even I who help you put in your information, I don't see whether you get approved or not. So if you don't get approved, and you don't need to share that information with me. You don't need to feel the shame or the embarrassment or anything. I don't know, regardless whether you got approved or you didn't. I don't see the amounts or anything. All I get is the confirmation, the credit card to pay for the vacation from them, and that's it. The payments, the way you work out the payments is between you and them once they get your information. And I've seen people use this service to the, like even one day before leaving. Um, and sometimes Uplift is so good. They work with a lot of travel companies so good. They work with Air Canada. They work with a lot of the travel companies. They're just trying to get their name out there and they want that good rep. They also, I've been in cases where I've called representatives on the phone to Uplift just for customers because they want to get away. And the representative from Uplift was like, yeah, sure, I, I can take care of your client. I, I, don't worry about it. Let me talk to your client. I will take care of it. We will get your client set up. And the client amazingly got approved the same time. All I saw within two minutes to my email was the credit card. Plugged in the credit card. Put that whole vacation package together. Sent the client off. And I think so, what, what, one of the plus is that from everything you're saying is is that service, is that relationship, is that going over and, and beyond. And and sorry for cutting you, just I'm looking at the time too, and we have to we have to wrap in a minute. I wanted to make sure if anybody had any questions or comments for you that we would give them an opportunity. I know I had one quick one. Um like for people, let's say for coming out, it's coming into town. Like right now we have some people coming into town and they need hotels. Like, does it have to be international travel or can you assist with just, you know, us getting good deals for hotels right here in Montreal? Is that something that you could offer? Uh, definitely. I could assist with getting hotels, car rentals, anything, anything travel related, even right here in Montreal. Okay. Um, even and if Fred. you're in Toronto. Great question. I got you. I got you. <laughs> so good. I'll call you. I was just about to book, so I'll call you before I do. Cool. Definitely. Just to compare prices, you know. I mean, you never know. So good. Okay. And and um. So be, before you give your contact info, so people could reach out to you. Did anybody else have any other questions? Um. I had a question. Uh, yeah. Um. You have, as a travel agent, you have traveled all over the world. What's your favorite vacation spot? Don't um, so I'm far, as don't say Jamaica. <laughs> <laughs> well, to be honest, I'm not going to say Jamaica because I've been Jamaica many times. Um, so I would say somewhere new that where I've been other than Jamaica, and that my favorite would be so far would be Dominican, the Dominican Republic. Yeah. It really got me when I went there. I was amazed. I I fell in love with Dominican. Nice. You should try Australia. <laughs> Ooh, Australia. That sounds awesome. It okay. should be a trip. Good. And I, I next admit... month I'm in Japan. Been <laughs> there. Mm. It's nice. Yeah. And all right. So I I, I I second DR. DR DR is awesome as well. I know I'm I've spoken to Darren about us coordinating an OFC trip to Trinidad for next year for Carnival. So mm. um, you know, if you get we 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 could discuss this, it might be fun to go as a group, um, you know, and go and uh, and go and party a bit. Um so Darren, please if you could share your contact info so we could close up. I'm sorry guys, we're we're a, a couple of minutes, well, a minute right now over our, our time. Um, I want to respect everybody's morning. So, Darren, if you could just give us a quick plug, let us know how to reach out to you, anybody who needs a travel consultant. So, definitely to reach out to me, my personal phone number is 
So I'll repeat, 514-298-8571. And um, the agency, if you prefer to see us in person, there's always somebody there, a consultant who's uh, there. But if you'd like to see me personally, just give me a call or text me. I will make sure that I'm there. We can set up an appointment and I will be there. Um, so the agency is located at 4945 Queen Mary Road. That's um, in Montreal. Right across from the dollar store, you'll see the agency. Amazing. And guys, and we had Darren on the uh, on the show this week. So his actually, you're going to hear his interview, not this week, actually his interview is going to air next week. It was awesome. Just deep diving about the world of travel and what inspired Darren to get involved. And again, Darren, I thank you for what you're doing. Uh, for all of us busy entrepreneurs, organization owners, um, guys, time is a huge value. And if we can save the time just by connecting with Darren as a travel consultant, um, I could vouch. It's been awesome just sending him random dates and, and my budget and uh, and him figuring out different options and coming back with different proposals, different travel itineraries and stuff like that. It saves, so, anyways, in terms of time, it's exceptional. So again, Darren, I thank you for what you're doing and I encourage everybody to reach out. Um, e like even if you aren't traveling yet and you want to know what's possible, please do. And Darren, I strongly encourage when you get those travel agent deals, please share them in the groups. Let us see that you have deals and opportunities. We, we might not have been thinking about travel, but to see a trip to the Dominican for three bills might want to, might, might prompt it, you know, might take a trip to Dominican for the weekend. So, and if you go on our website, um, actually I'll share my screen real quick, real quick. Okay. Uh, go ahead. And, uh, and shout out Preston. I see you, you just jumped in. And Janet, you had something you wanted to plug because now, now we're, we're gone over time, guys. I'm sorry about that. Yeah. Like, uh, um, oh. This can wait till next week or yeah. I'll put it in the chat. Okay. I'll, I'll share it in the big group. Okay, perfect. It's about the African Union. And okay, it's, good. It's but we, but we can take me. some time next week too, just to, okay. uh, so you can okay. put it. Thank you, sister. So I don't know if you see my screen. Uh, No, we're not seeing it yet. Oh. Mm. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to exit. What are you sharing? Uh, okay, do you see it's it now? Coming. It's coming. Yes, I see okay, it. Okay, perfect. So um, if you go on our website, um, what we have okay. is yeah. we have the option where you could get... Um, in your email, our newsletter, our weekly Thanks newsletter with uh -huh. deals oh, okay. right. and uh, prices. And oh. it gets sent directly to your email. So every week it's different deals, different prices. Like this one was one that was sent. So this is what our newsletter looks like. This is from one of our other agencies. Um, but you get like cruise deals and stuff like that. And you have the option of getting it in French and in English. Amazing. Awesome, Darren. Thank yeah. you for sharing you that. Okay, personalized so, weekly. Uh, okay, so on, so if we want, we just go onto the website and put in our email and then we could join the mailing list as well. Guys, this exactly. has been exceptional. Um, so I want to just close up and give a quick little promo and plug to Preston who, who jumped in. I shared my digital business card in the chat. Um, for you guys to see right now, Preston has a special going on. Buy one, get another one free, or basically just c connect with another OFC member and go half half on your digital business card. And it's exceptional for networking and you're helping save the planet, guys. So, with that, again, I am always grateful to life. I'm grateful to God, our creator, and our ancestors just for creating these opportunities for us to be able to get together on a weekly basis. And I just ask that life just continue to bless all your businesses, that they be able to continue to grow so that they could expand and allow you to continue to sustain yourself, uh, your family, as well as our community. Hotep, amen, and ashe, everybody. Wishing you guys an awesome rest of your day and looking forward to seeing you guys next week. Bye, everybody.